see you. Good morning, good morning, good morning to you. How y'all doing this morning? Good morning, baby. I had to use the bathroom. Soon as I got started, I had to go to the bathroom. This is ridiculous. Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning to you. Ooh, baby, y'all are piled up on any of this morning, ain't it? Hey, Antonio. Hey, my handsome nephew. Hey, Nita Todd. What's up, honey Chapman? Hey, my boy, keep turning up. Lisa Johnson, my boo, Albany, Georgia. Hey, Katanya Robinson, my sister. Hey, Veronica Cox, how you doing? Hey, Charlotte. Hey, Valerie Hall, what's going on? Mickey Fly, my sister now. What's up, Tam Franks? Hey, Tanya Howard, Carl Jackson, how you doing, handsome? Selena Evans, how you doing, darling? Hey, Carolyn Joyce, do know that I love you and you are definitely in my prayers. Hey, Charles. Charlie said, hey, girl. Hey, Kamisha. Hey, Jerry McCants, my man. What's going on, my ride or die? Tracy Taylor. Hey, good morning, good morning, good morning to you. Good morning, good morning, good morning to you. Hey, let's give them something to talk about. Understand me? Let's give them something to talk about. Understand me? Let's give them something to talk about. Understand me? Ooh, that kind of took a little breath out of me this morning. Hey, y'all. I am Kisha. Welcoming you to Kisha's Club, where I am called to encourage you, empower you, and inspire you to live your best life now. What I desire for you is for you to live, love, and laugh. Live your best life now. Don't wait till tomorrow. Start it today. Then I want you to laugh, honey. I want you to laugh till your cheeks start turning red. I want you to laugh till your nose start running. I want you to laugh until your tears start spinning. You feel what I'm saying? And then I want you to love yourself. I want you to love yourself first. And then I want you to love yourself. Somebody that's getting on your nerve. Understand me? Look, today we are going to talk about how 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 hot it is. Let me tell you something. It is so hot this morning that you can fry egg out there. I wanted to start walking. I ain't going to be able to do that out there. It is too hot, baby. It's too hot. It's too hot. You understand what I'm saying to you? This little itty bit of hat that I got on my head, baby, start to stand up and pucker. I ain't going to be able to do that. So let me tell you something. While you out today, and you know the children are out of school, and if you have your nieces and nephews, if you have your children that are under the age of 10, strap them babies down and get them out the car. Don't leave them babies in that car this summer. You hear what I'm saying to you? It's hot. Good morning. Good morning. It's hot, and those children will be burned to death. Think about what you're going to do, how you're going to do it, plan for the whole week. And then I seen on the news where they told you if you take your left shoe off and place it in the back where you've put your toddler child in, that you will be able to get them children up out of their seat. Don't let it be named among us in Mobile, Alabama, that we have left a child in the back seat of the car. It's too hot. And then let me tell you this. You know, I got that thing that you put on the, um, under the windshield, baby. Some, some, it keeps the heat down. Let me tell you something. Baby, all my seats in my car is left. Honey, I got in that car yesterday. Ooh, baby, I jumped to the roof. The back of my legs was on fire. My back was on fire because I had my little cute sundress on her there. Baby, I was hotter than a firecracker. So you know if it's that hot for my body, it's that hot for those children. You feel what I'm saying to you? And then another thing, baby, let me tell you something. It is so hot out there that you need to go get you some good deodorant. Go get you some good deodorant. Understand what I'm saying to you? Don't be sitting up there trying to use that suave and that little secret. See, that suave and that secret, that ain't going to hold me. Feel what I'm saying to you? I used that suave and that secret when I was a teenager. This here, this kind of heat right here, baby, 
This kind of heat gonna make you funky. Understand what I'm saying to you? <laughs> what I say. So what y'all gonna have to do is go get you some good deal. Go on get you that degree. Go on get you that tussie. Go on get you that Mitchum. Go on get you some of that um almond baker, almond hammer bacon soda stuff. You understand what I'm saying to you? It ain't no good look for a woman in this humidity of 100 degrees higher for you to be funky up under your arm. Understand what I'm saying to you? Uh-uh. Then the next thing. It is sundress season for the big voluptuous women. Feel what I'm saying to you? See this sundress? Cute, nice. Feel what I'm saying to you? Under yonder. Under here. Under here. I want you to go head on. I want you to shave. You understand what I'm saying to you, big voluptuous women? If you over 200 pounds like myself, baby, I'm going to need for you to go and get them clippers. If you're allergic to the rice or the clip of the rice or whatever, I'm going to need for you to go and shave that on up, shave that on down. And that thing got basic. It is too hot to be letting all the fumes come up from one of these sundresses. You feel what I'm saying to you? I'm already itching. Thinking about y'all. Oh, then the next thing. Ooh, let me tell you something. It is too hot to be bathing with all them uh, 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 deodorant soaps and things. You feel what I'm saying to you? We too big for them deodorant soaps and things. You understand what I'm saying to you? Them gift basket soaps. You feel what I'm saying? Go and get you some. Yes, honey. I ain't lying. Go and get you some Dove or something. That'll moisturize your skin. Moisturize your skin. Feel what I'm saying? Moisturize your elbows and thighs. Feel what I'm saying to you? It is not the time for you to be in Mobile, Alabama. Smelling like a billy goat. Everybody loves seafood. Y'all already know crawfish season here. Y'all already know you like boiled shrimps and crabs and things. Already know you want to go to them fish fries and things. I'm going to need for you to go head on and get you some panty liners. You understand what I'm saying to you? You got to change the panty liners on that on a regular basis. Feel what I'm saying to you? Understand me? You got to change them panty liners out, ladies. Go ahead on and change them out. Feel what I'm saying to you? Every time you use the bathroom, you need to be trying to change your panty liner out, ladies. That is a, ooh, honey, when I tell you the residue from when you use in the bathroom doing the number one or the number two, the residue gets on the panty liner. Feel what I'm saying to you? Understand what I'm saying? And when you walking in that friction, baby, that friction, it'll start a fire. It'll start a fire. I need for you to go ahead on and change them. You understand what I'm saying to you? Baby, and then what I need for you to do. Ooh, what I need for you to do. It's when you in a public facility or you going over to your friend girl's house because they got a little cookout and stuff like that. Walmart. Walmart has these little Lysol trial size. I want you to get you some little Lysol trial size. I want you to go and get you those. Go and get you those little antibacterial wipes. That come in that pack. Then I want you to get you some FDS. Because this summer here, this summer here is going to burn you up internally and externally. You understand what I'm saying to you? So when you go to these parties and things, you're at the day party at the Zaya Mama. You're at the low 
You at these like we finna have our all class reunion for Viagra. Let me tell you something. At that fairground, let me tell you something. When you come up out that restroom and that stall, that's your own little personal space. So before I smell you after I come in behind you in that stall, I can already smell that you smell like a mustard onion. You understand what I'm saying to you? Pissy and cone chipping. Pissy and cone chipping. I keep on trying to reiterate this, ladies, because I don't want you to be embarrassed to see what they do is. You be thinking they be your friend, but you know what they do? They be screenshotting you and sending it to me. They be telling me, ooh, she smelled like a pissy cone chipping mustard onion. See what I'm saying? See, I ain't got time to be putting you out there on the book. I ain't got time mm -hmm. to cut you like a knife. Cause see, you come in my face with all that mess. Tell me something. You ain't got no business talking about me on uh, 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 Facebook, baby. I'm just trying to tell you before they get you. Because they going to get you. Then they going to send it to me. And I'm just trying to tell you. See what I'm saying to you? So get your wipes. Get your Lysol. Trial size and get you some FDS. Clean yourself up. Clean yourself up after you get through doing what you're doing um, from the little parties. Then you, what you do is stop taking them wipes, flushing them down on folks' toilet. Because, see, that causes a backup and build up and things, and that's another plumbing part problem. You feel what I'm saying to you? What you do is when you get through with your panty liner and your little residue, you take you by one, two, three, four. Feel what I'm saying? When you roll that toilet paper up. Let me let me show you. Hold on. right here. Okay, so you got your pad. You know your cycle gonna come on if you still got one. You got your pad. So, this your little pad. You ball that up, you put it in your little purse. You see what I'm saying? Don't, don't have up in your purse and you digging around and you, you see all these pads and things and stuff like that. Don't do that, baby. Don't do that. So, you got your little pad. You feel what I'm saying? So, you got through with your little pad. Now, boom, boom. So, you take your pad with your residue on it. You take your pad. This is a clean pad. My chair ain't going to get me. You take your pad with your residue on. You feel what I'm saying to you? You roll that pad up. You understand what I'm saying to you? Yes, honey, make it fly. Them purple bur bird king honey. You take that pad, you roll it up. You feel what I'm saying? Don't just throw that up in there like that. Don't throw that pad up in there like that, like that, like that, because they got this little side thing on the side. You feel what I'm saying? That little, that little silver garbage thing on the side. Don't just sit there and throw that with all that residue on that pad and that garbage like that. That is nasty. And then I'm going to talk about you because, see, I done looked down and seen your feet on the other side of that dog on uh, 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 toilet area, you, you, the stall. You feel me? Don't do that. So what you do is you wrap this thing up. You wrap it up so tight and so hard. And then you take that first. See what I'm saying to you? You take this first. Hey, come on in here. Come on in here, tag love chef. Come on in here. You take that first tissue. And you wrap that thing. 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 And then see you turn it in like this. And you wrap that thing again. You see what I'm saying to you? You wrap it up, you wrap it up. And then like this here, you turn it again, you wrap it. You wrap it like it's a bandage. You wrap it, you wrap it, you wrap it, you wrap it, you wrap it. And then what you do, you tears it off. You tears it off and then you balls it up. You feel what I'm saying? Now my mama used to tell me, don't leave this here residue in folks' garbage can because they can put the voodoo and things up on you. So you understand what I'm saying? You used to take it and put it in a tree and then you're behind me crazy the next day. You feel what I'm saying to you? So what I teach my children when they was in school and things, wrap that thing up tight. Wrap it up tight. Wrap it up tight. You feel what I'm saying to you? Boo, y'all. Don't nobody know your business. Ain't nobody smelling you. Boom. Then you take your air freshener out that bathroom. Boom, boom, boom. You take your wipes. Boom, boom, boom. Feel what I'm saying to you? Throw all that up. Wrap that up. Throw it in the couch. Now I'm going to use my toilet paper. Cause this toilet paper good. You know what I'm saying? I messed that up right there. Okay, now boom. This your panty line. 
See how cute and poised these are. Now, as you use the big old sum, you need to get you a little wider, longer panty line. You feel what I'm saying to you? But these are going to be your good friends for this summer. Good morning, Kenya. I miss you, baby. You see what I'm saying to you? Now, let me tell y'all something. Get you some good adhesive panty liners. Don't nobody want to see you walking down the street and this coming down the side of your leg. You understand what I'm saying to you? This is not cute. You had this walking down the street on the side of your leg like it's a, 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 a dryer sheet. You feel what I'm saying to you? This does not look like a dryer sheet. Don't tell that lie when you, when you done got caught. Take these things, change them out every time you use the bathroom, ladies. Young ladies, ladies. Take them out. Take them, fold them back up. You feel what I'm saying to you? Roll them up in that tissue. Boo, y'all. Throw it in the couch. You understand? I'm just trying to tell you the right thing to do. You feel what I'm saying to you? These right here is hot. It is hot. It is hot. When I say it's hot, baby, it's hot. You gonna take these right here if you use these little things. Put them on up in you. Don't put them things all the way up here. You feel what I'm saying to you? You put them all the way up in your chest and the doctor can't even find them by the time he's trying to get them up out of That means you nasty and you don't change these things on a regular basis. I'm just trying to tell you. Understand what I'm saying to you? If you going to use these things, you got to be very wise. And using these right here, baby. Because if you don't, they'll send you to the hospital. It's been a diet. Well, feel what I'm saying to you. When you take this out and you see the string has the residue on this, you need to go ahead on and take that out. Pull that out with you. Pull this on out with you. With your tissue. Pull it out. Feel what I'm saying to you. Go ahead on and wrap that thing up. Wrap that thing. Don't flush this down on folks' toilet. This is another thing. You understand what I'm saying to you? Don't flush this down on people's toilet. I don't care if it do say it's flush, but it's not flush, but you better bag them folks' toilet through. Oh! Okay. Now, I done gave you that. You feel what I'm saying to you? Feel what I'm saying to you? On to the next thing. Let me tell you something. You... Me as a big full size plus one. I have a lot of junk in my trunk. You feel what I'm saying to you? Toxic shock, toxic, toxic shock syndrome. You sure right, Lisa? I'm just trying to tell them, sister law. Feel what I'm saying? It's hot, girl. I what? Somebody had to teach me. And my auntie taught me she was way back in the old days, baby. She was 60 years old when I got down here. She taught me by myself, my personal hygiene. You understand what I'm telling you? So if you a full figure woman and you got a lot of, hey, darling, hey, Robert, how you doing? If you got, if you a full figure woman and you got a lot of junk in your trunk, then I, it behooves me to tell you to take that rag. I'm going to need for you to take that rag. And I'm going to need for you to take that rag and go from the front all the way to the back. I want you to take that rag. Ooh! Ooh, I need some. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, y'all, hold on. That's that's me back there. That's me. Okay, feel what I'm saying? Okay, this your rag. When you in that bathe or in that shower, I'ma need for you to get that rag and get your under yonder right here. Hey Rache, Rache, I try to call you. I need for you to call me. I get your rag, baby. You feel me? Don't ball that rag up tell me some you you gonna wash yourself with this him right here. Don't do that. I, I'm telling you, Kenya. Robert, nigga, you know she can't use her shirt. Shut up, your crazy self. Don't use that rag balling it up like this. You open that rag up. Open that rag up, baby. You feel what I'm saying? Because it's a lot to wash up under there. Open that rag up. Soap it real good. And clean yourself. Feel what I'm saying? Clean yourself. All the way to the root of tutor. 
all the way to the ruler, to the up to your back. You got residue. Hey, Miss B. You got residue up under there. You feel what I'm saying to you? So let's do this one more time. You got this rag. Open it up. This here, clean yourself. From the front all the way to the back. All the way up to your back back there. And if you look at that, you can tell something been going on for quite some time. You understand what I'm saying to you? I just want you to make sure that you clean, ladies. Because the residue from back here, after you have um, defecated, that residue build up like grime up under the toilet stool. That's what I'm trying to tell them, uh, King. You got to wash all up in that increase in that back where your buttocks at. You know that your buttocks like this here. See that right there? You got to clean all that up there going up to your back. Because if you don't, you will have like beetle bugs. You feel what I'm saying? Then you back there scratching. And then up under your nail, you got all that stuff. That is not clean and sanitary. I'm just trying to tell you. You feel what I'm saying? Honey, shut up. Why are you laughing at me? I'm just good morning, Tasha. I'm just trying to tell people. It's hot, baby. Ain't nobody got time. To be smelling all this stuff. It's hot people. Attitude change. You know folks get mad when it's hot. I do. You feel what I'm saying? Let me tell you something. Don't. And throw that towel. And throw that towel. <laughs> Wait a minute. And throw that towel away and get enough. If they put a little bleach in their water. Just get you a little cap full. Now see if you're skinny. You can use a little cap full. But I'm, I'm, I'm thick. So I have to use two cupfuls, capsules. You feel what I'm saying to you? And then let me tell y'all something. Uh, I can't stand these wanna be bougie big women. I don't take baths. I just take showers. Baby, let me tell you something. Let hold on, I'm finna get this other thing. Hold on. Y'all gonna quit this mess. Y'all gonna quit this mess. Ooh, y'all gonna quit this mess. Baby, that tub, if that tub can hold 300 pounds and all this here, baby, it can hold your little two pound self. Quit lying, telling folks that's all you do is take showers and you be clean. Use a lie. Because if you ain't got no shower head hot, baby, that shower head, uh uh, you'll kill yourself up in there. Get in there and that thing need to soak. You know how you soak them clothes. Andrea, I ain't through with you, God. They need to let that thing sit in some water. I'm telling you, Andrea. They need to let it sit in there and put some peroxide in that water while they sitting in there, baby. And if that thing fills up, you know you got something going on. See what I'm saying to you? Now, I got this from Avon. This right here, when you, when you ain't got nobody at home with you, like I don't, and I need my back washed. See, it's something else when you can take this little thing here. All this, I don't like, I don't like basil with this because I want the base. Feel what I'm saying to you? I don't like this. This, this cute when you going like on your little date or you're spending the night over your little boyfriend house. That's cute. Make him thank you by something. But baby, I don't like this here because I got the scrub. I got the scrub all up. But I don't want this. And then I, I don't want that like that. I take this soap. Baby, I soap it sit down, baby. I soap it sit down. And baby, I get it like this here and get it like this here. Y'all so stupid. Y'all so stupid. Lift that leg up and that butt. <laughs> baby, I'm telling you for real. So I get this. And I wash it. Feel what I'm saying? I wash it, baby. That's my neck. That's my neck. Then I take it like this. And I go like this. Oh, you can even say, uh, 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 uh. And then I take it like this here. And when I take it like this here, boo, 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 boo. And then I take it like here and I go down here and I 
Uh, 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 uh. I can see that bag right there with your bro and baby. That bag, baby. Uh, 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 uh. See what I'm saying to you? Then you rank yourself out. Now then let me tell you something. I've seen some people on here say about that stomach. Let me tell you something. I ain't got one stomach, got, got, I got two. You feel what I'm saying? I got one here and I got one on the young. When you in that, baby, let me tell you something. When you in that and you taking you a shower or in the, sitting in that tub, you sitting in that tub, you get this here. And then you pick that up. You got to lift this up, baby. Lift this up. Get all that residue. See, I had a C-section, so you got to get that residue from up under there. You got to, you feel what I'm saying? Like swing low, sweet cherry, y'all. Pull that up, baby. Pull that up. Get that up right there. Pull that up. Understand what I'm saying to you? You got to clean that thing. You got to clean that thing. Hey, Lily, I'm just trying to tell you, come on in, come on in, come on in. I'm just trying to tell y'all. Because you know what? It's too hot, baby. I know it, Mickey. It's hot, Terrence. It's too hot. I know if I'm hot and I smell myself before I even get out there. I know y'all smell y'all self and then want to get mad when somebody be telling something. Don't get mad at them people. Don't get mad when, when somebody tell me something. When they see you, they be saying... If you ever in the company of somebody, <laughs> Lisa Johnson, they got rusty backs. If you ever in the company of somebody, tell something, and they talking to you, baby, you know you got something going on that they can't handle. That you got something going on they can't handle. That's good for the ones that can't reach all the way to that back of the. <laughs> Andrew, you know we don't cuss on here, good. Felicia January, what's going on? Rochelle, you know they be smelling like self. Rochelle, then mother used to tell us that. Mother say you can smell yourself for anybody else, man. You, I'm just trying to tell you. Let me tell you something. The heat index says it's going to be eighties and nineties. Good morning, same boy. It's going to be eighties and nineties and nineties and ninety nines this whole week. It's going to be rain. Do you know the humidity level? That means that if it says 95, it actually feels like 103. The humidity index is nothing to play with. We laughing, we playing this morning, but I'm, I'm, I'm being serious. Don't, be, don't let it be named among you that you smell bad. You feel what I'm saying to you? I want you to drink a lot of water. Get yourself hydrated this, this summer. It's going to be a well-being hot summer. If you have high blood pressure, if you are diabetic, um, you know, you need to read some of your medications and they tell you. My granny used to say, if someone else smells you, it's got out of control because you smell yourself first. You're absolutely right. Hey, Nicole. Hey, to the ones that um just coming in. Excuse me. We're talking about um it's hot and the things that you should or shouldn't do. Let me tell y'all something. Look on your medication bottles. Some of those medication bottles tell you that you can't be in a lot of sun exposure. You feel what I'm saying to you? Hey, my baby, Chandra. You can't be out there in that sun. You feel me? Hey, if they can use a towel, tell them to go to AutoZone and get a tie brush and wash up on it. <laughs> Rob Nichols, what I'm going to do with you? So listen, you better read. Good morning, Red. Good morning, um, Lady Lisa. How you doing? Um, you better read your medication because you don't need to go out. It, you show sure right. You don't need to go out in the sun and then been a passed out with a heat stroke. Don't do that. Use some wisdom this summer. Because I want to see y'all, you know, when I keep coming back for the fall and things. You feel what I'm saying to you? And while I'm talking, I'm trying to get my health together too. It is a shame that I am I'm weighing this much. 312 pounds, that ain't good for my heart. 
It ain't good for my back. It ain't good for my knees. You feel what I'm saying to you? And I have accepted that I'm beautiful, sexy, and voluptuous, but I want to be healthy. I want to be healthy in this season. So I'm trying to walk. I got out there this morning, baby. I wasn't going to be able to do that heat. You feel what I'm saying to you? I'm going to have to get in somebody, uh, 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 <sighs> in those stuff and start walking. You feel me? My doctor took me out of the gym, so I can't do that, um, I can't do that stuff, you know, that hard workout because of my knees. So I'm going to need some help. And then I can't take all these dietary supplements because of my high blood pressure. So I need something that will jump start. Good morning, my darling. Uh-uh, honey. 50 of that ain't, no, ain't my butt. 200 of it is my butt. Understand me? So I need something that will not affect my... Hey, Tammy Pate, my RN. I need something that won't affect my blood pressure. You feel what I'm saying? And I asked the, doc I asked the doctor about... Um, taking the diet pills. I asked the doctor about dietary supplements and he said, no ma'am. He said because yes, they do. He said because that that will affect your heart. I need some honey because baby I'm so tired of walking around here can't hardly breathe. You feel what I'm saying to you? That ain't cute. That ain't mm -hmm. cute. Now I'm a motivational speaker and the things that I have, the places that I have to go Sometimes I can't stand up long. Sometimes I can't sit long because of the sciatic nerves mm -hmm. in my back. But I'm I'm claiming Jesus that I'm healing every area of my life. Do you hear what I'm saying to you? Devil, you ain't finna get me because I got too many people I got to see and, and, and encourage and empower. You need to do a segment on some of these sexual women and let them know that they are still women. And they still have to take care of themselves like women because I done smelled a couple of them. Smell like a bag of Chekhov's onion, baby. I'm trying to tell you. That's why I do this, girl. And, Dre, I'm trying to tell you. That's why I do this. We be laughing. Good morning. Walk around the mall like the older people do. You sure right, Lady Lissay. I ain't even think about that, girl. Thank you. Work out in the house. Okay. Add a little apple cider vinegar in your water. Good morning, Tony. I have the same problems with my knees, my back, and my shoulder. Yep, Valerie, it ain't no joking. I have neuropathy, you know, that I deal with. Amen, healing Jesus' name. I appreciate that. I received that, uh, Monica. And I got the apple cider vinegar. You feel what I'm saying? So I said I'm going to start back doing that. But we need to be healthy, ladies and, and gentlemen. You feel me? God said he gives us long life. Will he satisfy thee? And I want to live my life abundantly like he ordained it to. But I have to realize if I don't do anything to discipline myself, then how am I going to expect God to help me? He ain't just going to say, hey, I told you stop eating this right here. He gives us a choice in every, in every situation in our lives. He gives us a choice. And my choice this summer is that I really want to be more healthier. Now, my trainer, D. Thomas, she says it's not all about the, the how much... Um, fat you can lose. You want to lose inches. You know, you want to do it healthy. And I hate I can't go to that gym because, baby, I was getting it in. You hear what I said? But I was falling out, about to die, ended up in the hospital. So I can't do that. So I am going to, um, my mom swears by Glucemin for her knees. Oh, okay. Baby, Lisa. See, me and you got to talk for real because, see, we got some things that we like, sister, sister, what you doing? You cooked in thing. Y'all, excuse my friend, Robert Nichols, on here. That's my good, good friend. And he, fought, he about to get beat up telling me something that I cooked in thing. No, I ain't cooked nothing. Come on, take me out the breath. Uh, I've also heard ginger is good. Okay, Tammy, we're going to get it together, okay? But what I wanted to do this morning was just trying to, you know, give you some fun facts. And then I wanted to give you a nugget that I could leave with you. You feel what I'm saying? Let's get a fresh start this week. Whatever you planned on doing, make you a to-do list. And if you can't get everything done, it's okay. If you knocked out one, it's okay. Don't beat yourself down. But I do want you to take care of yourself in this, this hot, hot, this hot, hot heat, okay? 
And y'all pray for the men and women that have to work out there in that heat. Because it is all it is awful. Do you hear me? That heat so disrespectful, y'all. Like Robert, he works for the uh a construction crew. He have to be to work at 2 o'clock and he work all day. You feel what I'm saying to you? He be out there in that heat. Y'all ought to see them black men out there working. Oh my God. And then the women that are standing there holding the signs. Flag the flaggers. You feel what I'm saying? Then the Mobile Water um, Area Board. Um, and then the um, the cable guys. You feel what I'm saying? Y'all pray for them. Because it is, it is, it is it's a mess out here now. Sylvia says, don't forget about the men. They come to the doctor office and I do vital signs and they be smelling tuna and... What? Sylvia! Sylvia, you mean tell me the men smell like tuna? Sylvia, don't tell me the men smell like tuna fish when you get up in there and they break... Go, go, baby! Don't tell me that, girl. My sister-in-law, Mika, says, start detoxing and drink Arden Garden Juices. At the health food store. What's the name of the store next to TJ Maxx on Airport Boulevard to get them? Um, you talking about Whole Foods? Oh, Virginia Health Food. They, they're not there anymore. If you're talking about Virginia Health Food, they moved on Dawson Street. But they got Whole Foods over there. Change. Take care of yourself. You, you better know it, Lisa. You better know it. Mm -hmm. Hey, Ida. Okay. Hey, Shay Packer. What's going on, Shay? But I'm just trying to say, you feel what I'm saying? We got to help one another. I don't know everything, y'all. And I need that. I need that in my life. I ain't trying to die early. 120 years is my portion. Do you hear what I say? And I want to be in my right mind. I know this lady, she 88 years old. Been there, done that. I used to be in a sawmill. Yep, you sure did, Mickey. Um, I know this lady, she's 88 years old. Bedridden. But she in her right mind. You feel what I'm saying? I don't want to be bedridden and in my right mind. I can't do nothing experience and enjoys the life that God has allowed me to have. I can't do that. I, You know what? Where I'm going, honey, I want to get on these airplanes. And I ain't got time to be asking no airline stewards to give me no extender so I can sit comfortably and be buckled down in that seat. That is not a good feeling. When I went to New York, baby... And I couldn't fasten that seatbelt. Ooh. Ooh. Then they looking at me all crazy and stupid. I want to say, what you looking at me for? Because I got enough junk in my trunk. Feel what I'm saying to you? But I don't want no extender this time when I go back home. I want to get in that seat comfortably. And I want to use the seatbelt that was designed for me to sit in. You feel what I'm saying to you? So y'all gotta help me. We gotta help each other. My friend girl got this, um, this, um, okay, it's Whole Foods. My friend girl has this thing that she does. Uh, she just started today, and it's called uh, Walk It Out. So a lot of them are meeting at the Cottage Hill Park, and they're gonna walk together. So then I heard about this, um, what is this? Herbalife? Herbalife, um, Dietary. <laughs> Herbalife dietary supplements. Um, they have um shakes and different things. That's right, Mickey. So I'm I'm gonna check into that. And then my friend girl Alma and Jamila Simmons, they sell the um ISO T. So they say that works good with the resolution drops. Um I'm just you know trying to find out what's going on. Now let me tell you something. I ain't finna be up here lying. Hey Nicole. I ain't finna be up here lying, tell me something. You gonna see me working out and then and then I'm sweating and all this. I'm not finna even put myself out there. You feel what I'm saying to you? I can't stand when folks do that, but you do what you want to do. You want to tell folks you're out here losing weight, doing whatever you got to do. Then the next couple of months, you done stopped all that because you see everybody else doing that. So you want to do it. So then you know you can't keep up with it. So you say, I'm not finna be doing that. I ain't finna be doing Facebook lying. Understand me? Y'all just keep me in your prayers because I'm trying to lose this weight. Girl, those things were made for paper thin white women, not sister with butts. <laughs> Honey, chap, you so stupid. <laughs> hey, Darnisha, well, baby, let me tell you something. Darnisha, well. Darnisha, well. 
Siri, them men don't bathe. Ba I say, they show sure don't. Don't need your web. I just want you to say yes, ma'am. Don't need your web. I want you to say yes, ma'am. Let me know. You know I'm talking to you. You hear me? Don't need your web. Please say yes, ma'am. Let me know you still on here. Mick Flat, you show sure right, baby. You show sure right. Yes, yes, yes. Darnisha, um, I love you. And when I get off this broadcast, if you ain't doing nothing, I'm going to inbox you uh, my number because I want to talk to you. Okay? Mwah. Um, Listen. Well, today has been a great morning. Okay. Today, Brandon Todd, I need to talk to you. It's, a, it's sad that you stay right down the walkway and I can't get in contact with you. You won't answer your phone. You see my number. So that lets me know that you ain't locked my number in. I done locked your number in. You ain't locked my number in, honey. Um, I want you to live and I want you to laugh and I want you to love. So I have, gave, I have given you all three of those this morning. I want you to enjoy yourself today here. Yeah. Go make it a great day, but only if you put God first. Incorporate mm -hmm. him in every aspect of your life on today. Invite him in. Let him sit down and eat with you. Let him sit down and watch the movie with you. Let him go to work with you. Let him ride home in the car with you. Let him ride to work with you. Um, put you on some good motivational music, you know, to start your morning off and help you throughout the day. You feel what I'm saying to you? And y'all got the phone. So won't you go ahead on and get that Bible app called you version? Eat fruits and vegetables and water only. Okay. Um you got the Bible app app called you version. Won't you go on in there and get the verse of the day? And just meditate on the verse of the day. You feel what I'm saying? Even if you got things going on um, around you. If you kind of put, if you would put the word of God in your life. That's right, Monica. If you would put the word of God into your life and incorporate that. It won't be so bad. You feel what I'm saying to you? And then hang around some good people. Hang around people that inspire you. Hang around people that, you know... Um, that motivates you and catapults you. And then hang around somebody. Surround yourself around somebody that challenges you to do better. Vanessa Leverett, can you please call me, honey, because we got to talk. Is that Vanessa? Is that Lisa? Hey, Lisa. Um, so, I got Darnisha Webb, I got Brandon Toy, and I got Vanessa. I won't talk to y'all when I get up off this live. Mm -hmm. Understand me? I love y'all, and I will talk to y'all later. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Make it a great day. Remember that um, I love y'all, but God loves you more. Bye-bye.